Today I'm out in Naples again with the Nikon Z6 II and we're, I, I, we're gonna do some tests on one piece of the formula when doing sports photography. And I'm, I, I'm really curious of what this setting's gonna do. So in, in a previous video, I did a video on can the Z6 II shoot sports? Well, one of the settings that I didn't really change was the, the autofocus uh, sensitivity setting. And let me show you what setting that is on the menu system. autofocus and focus tracking lock on there's a sensitivity uh, setting I'm going to there's these guys are going to do four laps so I'm going to set this to one two four and five um, I've already done three in a previous video the whole time the camera was on three and we're going to see if there's any change in the success rate of these of the pictures by changing this sensitivity setting from quick to delayed. So again, I'm I'm there. I'm doing the the ride they call the Hour of Power uh, again with the Nikon Z6 II, and I'm going to test the settings that I just talked about. Um, I'm also using the Nikon Z 24 to 70 f.28. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm going to use the 70 to 200 today f2.8 lens and it'll be in uh, set to a dynamic focus point, um, auto ISO, and um, it'll be in the shutter, sp shutter speed priority mode. Okay, they're going to be coming around for lap one, and I have the uh, um, focus tracking with lock on and I set the block shot autofocus auto <laughs> I set the block shot autofocus response to quick so this will be lap one and the response rate will be set to quick okay that was the first lap they just went by and with that setting set to quick on one, just looking at what I saw in the viewfinder, not too impressed. Uh, but I'll save my final thoughts until I get these loaded into Lightroom and see what happens. So the next lap, which they'll be coming around here pretty soon, I'm gonna change that setting to uh, two. Okay, instead of boring you with watching me take pictures, of uh, the, the next three or so laps and um, you guys I think you find you kind of got the point so I thought I'd just come back uh, here to Lightroom and dive into what the results were so I separated each lap out um, lap one lap two three and four and then like I said the adjustment that I was changing in the camera was the block shot autofocus response setting. Um, you can find that in the setting menu on the Nikon in the custom settings menu under autofocus, which is A, and then the number three under A is focus tracking with lock on. And once you go into there, you'll see the different levels you can adjust the camera to one being quick and five being delayed. So with that being said, lap one, this is lap one. I went back and went through and starred all the ones that were out of focus. And eight out of the 29 pictures in lap one um, were in focus. So the 
So that means that's roughly 28% of the shots were in focus. Um, I was expecting a little better with the one setting, uh, but for some reason, it, uh, for this series of pictures, it, it didn't seem to work out. Um, so, uh, yeah. So let's look at lap two. Lap two, I moved the setting to two, and the results were a lot better. Out of 31 pitchers, 22 were in focus, which gives me about a 71% success rate. Not too bad. Lap three, when I set the setting to four, this is when things started to get really bad. Um, out of out of 22 pitchers, only four were in focus. 18% uh, of the shots were in focus. And lap four um, gets even worse with the setting set to five, which is the most delayed. Three out of 28 pitchers were in focus, so only 11%. Now in a previous video, I had uh, left the camera set at in the middle at number three and the results from that video I went back and counted all the pictures and what was in focus versus out of focus in that video the one where I talk about using the Nikon Z6 II for sports 74 out of 105 pictures were in focus that gave me about a 70 percent success rate so it seems to me like you, using number two or number three in that setting seems to give the best response. Now, I could be mistaken. Lap one, um, it was a little more towards dusk. Might have had a little bit something to do with it. Not quite sure, but I, I would have thought um, with the setting set to the quickest uh, response, it, it, the results would have been a little bit better. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, make any comments, ask any questions you like uh, below. Uh, if, you, if you like it, please subscribe and click on the bell so you get notified of future video uploads that I, I've, got, I've got planned. Um, again, I appreciate you watching this video and taking the time. And we'll see you in the next video.